migraines. Perhaps you've noticed. Perhaps you think there's a connection between the pain that you feel and the weather outside. If you've made that link, you're certainly not alone. Yeah, a lot of people feel that way, and our Kelly Green today took a look at the common causes of migraines caused by the weather. Yes. Oh. Dawn Culvert suffers from migraines, and she knows that the changes in the weather will bring on a migraine. The main um, weather-related triggers are rainy weather, but especially stormy, like thunderstorms, for sure, are ones. Like, anytime I look into the sky and I see those big, dark, gray, bluish clouds, I'm like, uh-oh, here we go. Some migraine sufferers are so sensitive that they even know when the weather's going to change a day or so before it does. Dr. Vogel, a neurologist, says the weather is one of the largest causes of migraines. Probably more than two-thirds of patients with migraines will note that a weather change, particularly a drop in the barometric pressure, but also extreme heat or extreme cold, will trigger a migraine. So what happens typically is when the barometric pressure changes, the pressure in our, in our head and neck changes also, and it has to equilibrate with what's happening in the atmosphere. I just notice, like, even, even as I see the clouds rolling in, almost as soon as the, the rain starts, that's when my, my head starts to get grouchy. Dr. Vogel suggests keeping a diary. Please keep a diary and write down what has happened to you around the time of your headache occurring. And people will then start to see a pattern. So if you suffer from migraines and you know it's brought on by the weather, there are ways to prevent the migraine or at least minimize it. For many people, an over-the-counter medication is just fine. Uh, where that becomes a problem is if you're taking handfuls of it every day because that can also cause um, medical side effects. There's been a lot of changes in the last few years. Uh, New class of medications have, have uh, been released onto the market, the calcitonin gene-related peptide antibodies. They are very, very effective for migraines. When I see the clouds moving in, I go ahead and take my medicine because it's coming. I know it's coming. Indiana does have frequent changes in barometric pressure. Now, weather-related migraine sufferers have options to weather the storm pain-free.